Hi guys, Ravio Between Worlds here. One week ago, E3 happened, and Nintendo showed off uh, lots of awesome games. So, in the coming videos, and in this one, I'm going to give you my thoughts on all the games Nintendo has shown us. Every video, one game. And today, we're going to talk about an awesome game called Super Mario Odyssey. So, Super Mario Odyssey is basically like the Breath of the Wild in the Zelda series, but then it's a Mario game. And that's meant with two things. Super Mario Odyssey is like a revolutionizing Mario game, just like Breath of the Wild was. And, you know, the game looks awesome, like the graphics are great, and it just looks amazing. And it's as I said, just like the Breath of the Wild, but then the Mario version, because it really has lots of freedom and exploration and big areas. Really cool areas like New Donk City, which is like a big metropolis, and you got a woods area and a desert area, and like the, what's it called? The Spanish town thing, something like Cabarena Town or something. And I really like that, that they had like really big areas to explore. And there are really cool new features like you can capture um, enemies or cars or whatever, even humans in the games, with your cap, which is called Cappy. And that basically means you can control a Bullet Bill or a Goomba or a Koopa Troopa, and that is just so amazing. Instead of jumping to a different platform, you can just conquer a random Bullet Bill and fly to the other side. Which I think is really cool, and they really added in some new races and characters and things. And every area has its own style, you know. Like in the desert, there are these um, sphinxes that you can ride, which is really awesome. And there's these big statues. They're called like Moa, Moa statues or something. And you can also conquer these, which are really cool. And they all got their own character into it. And I really think this game is going to be amazing. There's lots of collectibles in the game. You know, every area, every region has its own currency. Which I think is really original. They really put in some original things into this game. And it really... Uh, Mario really has its his own character. Like, when you go into the woods... It's gonna be really cool and stuff, but there's also the scary woods where you can really see Mario being like really scared, you know, he's like, oh, it's kind of scary here. It's really funny to see that. And, you know, just all the secrets and exploration you can do in this game. I think it's amazing. I think the areas in the game look really cool. And I would just love just walking around the desert, you know. I, I love the Grido Desert in Breath of the Wild just simply walking across it even though it's just sand and I will love it in Super Mario Odyssey 2. Sadly enough I don't have a Nintendo Switch but I will buy one definitely to play this game. So that basically wraps it up I think. That's my thoughts on Super Mario Odyssey. I really want to buy it and Thanks for watching, these were my opinions and thoughts, so thanks for watching, uh, please subscribe, like and share this video if you want to, and thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.